Hey everyone, Lensman Oz and the kids back for another episode of Enigmatica 2. Uh, say hello kids. Hi. Hello. Hello. So uh, we've got a bit of lava in the smeltery here. I've made a couple of things. I made a, a, a ingot cast. Um, put all the wrong things in here and it looks like someone went for a swim in there because there's blood in there as well. Um, but and we know, and we all know who. I'm guessing it was Manx. Just a guess. Uh, so I've got. I started building a uh, a mine shaft over here, but before I did, I went for a bit of a trek. So here's here's the mine shaft, and this has a really nifty mod in the mod pack where if you look up on the ladder, I'm not pushing forward. It um. It's it, it moves you up the ladder, so you don't you don't have to push forward or anything. You don't have to do anything as long as you're looking up. It will um take you up the ladder. Uh, so down here, uh, and the look, the server is on peaceful. I've, I explained that last episode. But down in this area, and I haven't lit it up yet. Not that it particularly matters, but just for you guys so you can see. Uh, I was doing a bit of spelunking. Collecting up some ores, and I came across this. Uh, so I broke into it, and this is some sort of dungeon. Um, I'm not 100% sure what puts this dungeon in here. The pack does have recurrent complex, so it could have come from that. But it's a nifty, and as I said, pack's on peaceful, so this isn't going to cause any dramas. I don't think there's anything out here. So this is a nifty little um, area, and I don't know why that's double, double hitting. And these chests are chock-a-block full of stuff. So we've got a Lexic Botanica, uh, an Ender Orb Translocator, which is a reusable Ender Pearl that carries you. Drone, some Iridium Melon, some Ingots. That's fine. I'm going to get the re request reward for the um, Lexic Botan Lexica Botanica. Uh, down here there are uh, there is another chest here, which has a bunch more stuff, some black quartz. Uh, so new mana crafts in the pack, so some mana steel, some other bits and pieces of tin, some iron. And I'm now out of out of room in my inventory. So I will head back upstairs and I need to smelt a book. So smelt a book. I uh, don't have a book. I'll make a book. I need to find reeds. Uh, there's some in the greenery chest. Ooh. Ooh, there's some nifty stuff in these chests. Another bucket. A magic bean. Interesting. Take that. I'm going to take that. It's in this one. Ooh, a garden scythe. And another Lexica Botanica. I can't pick up two, but I can. There's another bucket. That's cool. Spare spot. I want to take this redstone with me, though, so saddle can go back. Cool. I'll come down and get those other things a bit later. But these things will definitely help us out. So, heading on back. What you doing, buddy? You're holding the button down. I know it's dragon holding the button down. Sorry, it's it's also my run. Ah, well, maybe you should rebind. Caps caps lock or something else. Oh, okay. Anyway, heading on up. I want to see what these uh, things I just collected do. So we got the the garden scythe. So cyclics a mod in here. Um, that adds a few things, uh, and they're all sort of random bits and pieces from what I've seen. Um, but it's definitely got some really cool stuff in it, so it adds the ability to have experience in buckets. Uh, it's got a forester, so it plants saplings and harvest logs, which is cool. Uh, let's see, there was another thing. A sprinkler. Got an item collector, so it's a vacuum chest, basically. 
Fuses, concrete, and other blocks. Okay, that's cool. Powered anvils and structure builder, a harvester. So you can have a, an, an automated farm from this. So automated user. I do believe there's a there's a farm one as well. Pete Farmer. Got a feeling. But somewhere in here there's a there's a farm unless it just harvests using that harvester but these are this is pretty cool i wanted to potentially look at getting a couple of these things so controlled miner block breaker with size controls black blister okay uh so the harvester it requires diamond and obsidian but other than that it's actually fairly cheap nether quartz is where we're gonna stumble for us but once you get into that it's it's a very cheap and, and easy way of doing things. So we can make a tree farm with this, just a daylight sensor, which again needs quartz. Um, but yeah, um, something I'm going to look into probably at a later episode is a way of using these things to make things um, grow a bit quicker. Ooh, that's pretty neat. A nice little sprinkler. So you can make a normal farm. So let's try that. Let's. Do kids have anywhere designated as a farm? Nope. Alrighty. Here it is. One, two, three, four. Okay, I don't know how this thing works. Harvest and replant large areas. So I probably need to make a normal... normal sigh. So let's... Whoops. Uh, can you take that bucket, buddy, and put the water in this hole? I'll just empty some stuff out. Yeah, just that hole that's right nearby. Okay, done. Cool. I'm just going to make... Uh, just, uh, a cheap and nasty vanilla hoe here. Now, while we're doing this, let's make a sprinkler. Bone blocks. Can I make bone blocks? So bone blocks comes from bone meal. A bucket of water and some iron bars, really? Okay. Well, I'm going to run downstairs and grab all those bones that were down there. Do do do. Ow. Ooh, missed that before. Ouch. Got to stop dropping. Can I use skulls? Mm. Can you be used to make bones? Oh, take it anyway. Right here. They will come in handy. And I'm back up. Probably not going to be enough for me. Uh, so a few other things we've got in here is uh, actually additions. So we could probably make a nice little grinder and powered furnace. So perhaps we'll look at that. So if I do use these, I'm only going to get eight. Do we have any more? Pretty much need one more bone. And I'm not going to get it, am I? Alright. Change of plans. Unless one of you guys has a... A bone? Nope. Yeah, I don't think we can do anything with it. Oh, 
that's interesting. An inventory upgrade. You eat this and you get a bigger inventory. That's pretty cool. Empty sack of holding. Hmm. I got tiny torches. Yeah, I left them down there. So Alright. Getting, you know, this is a thing. I'm getting a little bit, a little bit sidetracked. We did get a quest though, didn't we? Ooh, we got one for Iridium. So I'm going to take a loot chest. I thought we got one for something else. Huh, sugar cane can go past three in this. Cool. So there should be two quests that you guys can collect and grab a loot chest for each. Okay. I've got a phantom face. Ooh. Okay. And please don't use these things to explode things. The EF EFLNs. Apparently they explode. I don't it want to know. just tempted me. I'm gonna... <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Okay. Just planted some magic we're, beans. We're, we're normal. Just, just don't mind us. Is there don't a water... plan to destroy everything. There's a watering can. Yay! Some stone and a bowl. I can make that. Okay, watering can. Really want to grow this magic bean. Let's see what it does. Cool. Ooh, 14, 28, 42. It's cool how it changes colour. Aha. I harvest it. Look out. Oh, it still stayed there. What did I get? I don't even know what I got. Random junk. I think I got a sapling from it. Yay. Hang on. It's two now. Once it grows full, I uh, will can right click it and we'll um we'll have a look. So the left one is ready to go. Right click the left one. You got a pumpkin and another bean. Plant the bean. This is one way of getting some random junk, isn't it? If we make that whoop, I got I've got some brown wool. Oh. And another magic bean. There we go, here's his is a junk farm, so <laughs> we can um, put a sprinkler on this. And we'll get a whole bunch of random stuff. Interesting way of getting started if you were, I guess, doing a, a sky block or something like that. Oh, did you get kicked, Jamrel? Yeah, ages ago. Oh, didn't realise. Sorry, doll. My hurt. I was rejected. Don't know why. I clicked the wrong button. Oh, you quit. <laughs> Whoops. Woo! <laughs> are you gonna harvest the two that are done, buddy? Let's see what junk you get. Oh, you got a mushroom and a potion. A bottle of enchanting. There's no cows in the area, is there? I don't know, you'd have to look. I reckon we definitely work on uh, getting some bones for this thing. Alright, I'm gonna put a cut in. I'm going to see what I can come up with. Just give me a few minutes. And uh, hopefully we can come up with a little bit of a plan to make, to make this a little bit more usable. So be back in a moment. Okay, we're back. I dug down the bottom of my uh, my mining shaft here. And this place is pretty full on. I've so far got 19 diamonds, 60 lapis, almost two stacks of redstone, some gold, some iron, some lead everything and it's just in this tiny area so i've only gone as far as there 
and as far as just around the corner over here and there's still heaps around I haven't grabbed everything but I went to the top of that piece there and I've got a lot of uh, materials so definitely know where I'm going to be coming back to go mining so let's head on back up I'm not going to push anything you just shoot up Whee. Uh, what I was going to do is just basic stuff when I was out and about I was over over here and there's a village so pretty much due north of our base is a village and in that village was an actually additions house and in there and obviously there was a a massive engineering house as well that's why I've got crates uh, in there was some stuff so I got some iron casings and some black quartz and a nori um, made the watering can earlier uh, got some wood casings got a few bits and pieces so what we can do with this um, is a few things we should hopefully be able to come up with a basic power system there's a void block as well I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to need I think I'm going to need some of this but let's just swap that out uh, I'm going to drop off some ores and a bit of this and a bit of that uh, marble can go in there all right so get rid of some of our hall so what I was thinking I need two diamonds. Uh, in this chest here with all the, the other ores and stuff I'm just gonna make a really really basic uh, generator it's just a coal generator and then eventually I'll probably make an oil generator which you know I could almost make that from the get-go but we don't have canola yet so I was just gonna make one of these and then uh, a crusher so we just need some cobble iron casing and some and a couple of charcoal which I have are oh, you making your book yep gonna make another table I need clay. Uh, is in one of those chests. Okay, so there's our coal generator. And I've got an actually additions book, which probably did unlock a request, maybe. Uh, I'm going to make an atomic reconstructor, which I'm going to need four iron for. So hopefully no one's stolen all the iron. For them... Ah, someone got the cooking for blockheads. Uh, let's see here. I've lost it. It's gone. Make an atomic reconstructor. I've done the quest. Mm -hmm. That was weird. I am lagging. Lots of things have happened because Dragon went off looking for... Um, Cows. Looking for cows. I have yeah. fridge now. Cool. Mini fridge. Oh, you can just make a second one and put it on top. I'll get there. So, coal generator. Uh, I don't even know where to put this now. This plate there is going to be a bit messy. Uh, Manx found a bunch of actually additions worms, so he's thrown them down out here. I don't know if they're actually affecting these like they like I thought they would. Nah. Not sure yet. Need to work on that sprinkler. Now this can just go here for the moment. Turn that to pulse. Uh, how do you make a watering can again? Uh, it's in the one of the end chests. Uh, well, actually, one of the crates. So go behind there. Yeah, one of those crates there has it in it. Let's get this and give it a bit of fuel. So what do we need? I want to make a crusher. So I'm going to need a couple of Restonia crystals, a couple of basic coils. So we're going to need two, four. We're going to need ten redstone turned into Restonia. Nice. 
Uh, what else do I need? A couple of pieces of flint and some cobble. Okay. Anyone got any flint? In my chest. Yep, got them. Cool. Let's see if we can make this so... Uh... Two of them. Awesome. So that's a crusher. Just gonna pop him on there for now. This will just give us the ability to to double without having to deal with the mess that this can become. Some more iron. And I wonder if. What do we get? So if I put one of these in here, I'm going to get three. What do we get in here? Six. Very nice. So that will get us closer to the sprinkler that I want to make. The bars. Oh, I brought up the bucket of lava from down below. We're going to need to make a tank. It's got to be on the list. How you going there, buddy? Getting there? Yeah. Alright, we needed three of them. Some of them and this gives us a sprinkler. Now, apparently, if I place this here. Oh yeah, look at that. Did you harvest that or do it do it itself? I harvested. Ah, cool. That's impressive. That's actually quite um quite decent. What are you doing? Oh you're watering as well. So we got a few What are we getting? We're getting puffer fish, we're getting clay. We're Pink getting terracotta. Cool right, just, garbage disposal. just let the sprinkler do its thing, buddy. Oh, you got some um some nether water as well. How many more of those seeds you got? Seven. Oh, place them down. You can get a real junk farm going on here. The only thing we can't get will be the auto harvester because of the nether quartz and I don't have an, any obsidian yet but that's doable blocks of quartz though did I see quartz downstairs before or is that marble? it's probably marble no idea it's probably marble food dump let's get rid of some of this stuff Oh, nice. That'll come in handy. I got a 64 stack of stained glass with one plus. That's weird. You sure that wasn't from a chest reward or anything? No. Nice. So I think we just found our way of getting stuff real easy. Uh, I do want to potentially make another farm like this with a harvester on it and um I wanna leave. Yep. And look at doing actually additions canola in it. Let's see Ooh, how that goes. Spice rack. Well the spice rack will go great in uh, Dragon's Kitchen. I already have one. You've already got one? Yep. Alright, so you guys actually claimed a couple of things there before, didn't you? I got an actually editions manual. Aha. Nice. Apparently I also need to find black quartz ore. But that'll be um this one here has already been done because we made the atomic recon reconstructor. 
Uh, where was the one you were doing, Dragon? Eating starvation. Cool. Uh, do you want me to get the other fridge, or are you right? Uh, I've got a fridge, but you can put another one on top if you want. Or a tool rack. What the junk's fun? We, you eventually need... Oh, actually, we get all of it, don't we? Yep. Wow. You've gone to town there, buddy. Yes! Uh, you're going to need to move one of the tool racks for me to put... Best junk farm ever. The other fridge in. I love it. That'll do. Mega junk farm. Okay. Actually, I need just the fridge. <gasps> for a moment. It's in your base. I got an advanced solar generator as one of my quest rewards. We've got RF. Yay! Didn't need to do much at all when we got RF power. Look at that. Nice. Obviously, we need cables, but it's generating 160 RF a tick. Definitely going to come in handy. Quest rewards are great. Uh, I did make a, um, a scoop, by the way, and I did pick up some bees, but uh, not enough to trigger any other. Oh, hang on. Dragon's just done another one. We get a lot of ovens and stuff. Don't know how many ovens we need. What's that, buddy? I got an unbreakable wand! Nice. Holy moly. So, the free stuff chest is going to get quite full. Got all sorts of things. We got like. blocks of ironwood. I have and a rainbow oak you. sapling. You were? Rainbow oak. Oh, I'll place it out there somewhere. From what? The junk farm? Let me guess. Don't go too far, buddy. It doesn't go out that far. It's as far as it goes, so just be careful how far. It's only four out from the water source. Cool. Hey, Dragon, you can keep all the ovens. I have enough. Yeah, put it in your base somewhere. Many no. torches equals life. Really? Yes. Wow. Many torches. Whoops. There's a lot of junk here. I need a bucket of water. Uh. Oh, I'll throw it at Manx. You want a bucket? Here, have a bucket. <laughs> Keep getting blocks. Keeps giving me blocks. Getting all sorts of stuff, aren't we? It grows on dirt. Who gave me the battle wrench? Me. Okay. Why? Oh, you don't want it? What do I do with it? Um, it's a battle wrench. It's got nothing on it. It's, it's got no power. We'll need to make an energy cube and you can charge it up. Aye. Currently it's useless, so I'll go on a chest. Yeah, put it in the uh, the rare stuff chest, I guess. What about the eight barbecue pulled pork things and prismarine? Well, food. Um, putting like gems and stuff into this one. So all of our. They're full blocks. Ah, uh, well, if they're full blocks, put them in the bottom one. Got an apple from one of these randomized thingies. Junk things. I got pink dye, buddy. You're gonna get all sorts of weird and wonderful stuff. So. I think next episode we'll look into making the harvesters. So for that we're going to need quartz. And that's either finding um, 
I Blinding. also got a bucket from you. Blinding blocks of quartz? Or it's uh, us heading to the nether? So I'm not really sure if I did see it down here. I think it was marble that I saw. It was at the end of one of these. Someone is making all sorts of stuff. Yeah, so it's marble. That's unfortunate. Would have been nice if it was quartz. Alright, so that's another quest done. Well done, kids. Alright. So that being said, I think we are at the wrapping up point. We didn't get a lot done this episode. We definitely handed in... You have a toaster? Yes. So you can make toast now. Eventually. I just got blaze powder. You got blaze powder from it? Yeah, that's all weird. So if anyone gets quartz, um, we're going to make a farmer thing for it. Harvester. I want to try something. I know mm -hmm. Because it calls the sink unlimited milk and water. Yes. We all have a toaster now. It's like you had a housewarming and got too many toasters. Apparently you can put water in this. Yes. It's mainly used when you're cooking. Your rainbow tree looks pretty cool. I found marble! Don't need marble. I'll tell oh. you the truth, it's not as colourful as I thought it would be. No, I think it's random, random chance of becoming big. Oh, inventory's full, so it does, it's not giving me any drops. It's actually just not giving me any drops. It's weird. It is a bit weird. Be glad that we got the toaster as a gift. Why is that? It would be needing everything iron and lava. Eh, not a big issue. We got all sorts of stuff now. Anyway, with that, I am going to wrap up the episode here. Uh, thank you all for watching. Leave those comments below. We'll work towards getting some sort of harvester here, and then I think we're going to need to do some farms elsewhere, maybe. Lots of stuff to do in this pack, really, and it's kind of that thing of not really sure where to get started from. Uh, there's a couple of pages on mechanisms, so maybe that's a good place to, to go. Uh, and there is page or two on actually editions, but I'm going to need to find some black quartz before it unlocks all of that stuff, so black quartz we'll need to find while we're out and about digging so I don't know whether there's a uh, there's a one stack and 24 marble don't know if it shows us what level this is at oh yeah, it does tell us Highest amounts at Y55. Now oh, that's in Stellar Dimension there. Where's the overworld? Ooh, these are all different. Whoa. I don't know if that's a spoiler. That could be a spoiler. What do you mean? All the different areas where you can get, um, get this ore. There's 22 pages of it. So Y39. Yeah. So maybe, really quickly, we are over time, but eh, that's fine. Let's just duck down here to there. And dig this way a little bit. Maybe, that's not probably not going to work. We need to dig here. I'm going to go looking for something. Uh, quartz ore of some description. Hopefully I'll find some in here somewhere. But with that, this is the wrapping up point. Someone's just made themselves some iron tools. No, I just got a piece of iron from the junk farm. 
Yeah, cool. It's definitely giving you everything. Uh, yep, we're going to look around for this this ore, and hopefully when we get that, it's going to unlock a few things. Sometimes it doesn't even give you any stuff. Yeah, no, it's a bit bit weird at the there for a bit. Uh, so we'll do this in between, and hopefully come back, and we'll have a couple of quests to hand in for you guys. And oh, hang on, we don't need to go anywhere. Look, I found some. Awesome black quartz. What? Quickly head on up. And the atomic reconstructor. There you go. So we d I didn't need to do... Oop, going up. Didn't need to do much. And the crusher. Hey, we got lots of quests done this episode. It's so laggy. Let's dump this stuff off. Let's check in our book. Uh, loot chest. Loot chest. And apparently there's another one which we haven't gotten to yet. Well, this is one for Crusher, but I don't see the Crusher here. There's a bubbly water bottle here. Hmm. I can make bubbly water. Nice. Uh So everyone gets bubbly water? Mm -hmm. Okay, so there's obviously yeah. stuff in here that isn't showing because there was another quest that magically unlocked there that we didn't get to see for the crusher, so it's cool. What did I get? I got a scanner from Scannable. I have no idea what Scannable is. And chisel factory blocks. Cool. Okay, with that, that's definitely it. Thanks for the bubbly water, kids. Uh, we will wrap up. Only and thing I could make. Next episode, we'll do something else. All right. Cool. No worries. There's a fridge in the middle of the field now. You can tell things have gotten weird. Don't question it. All right. Never question it. Thanks everyone for watching. Say goodbye, kids. Bye. Bye. And we'll see you next time. Bye now.